And we're doing this presentation to clear up some um, mistruths that are out there about coconut flower and cobra. So what then is cobra? Cobra is the dried elements left over from making coconut oil. So what's the history of this? Well, first, we came up with a coconut flour product um, a little more than a year ago uh, called Cuckoo for Coconut, organic coconut flour. Within about two months, um, we uh, had already sold probably a thousand bags of our coconut flour and we were right uh, ahead of um, or behind Nutiva, the multi-million dollar natural foods company. And we were looking for some partners to work with because we were trying to get as many people as possible healthy. Well, I ran into a woman who told me about where Copra comes from. She claimed that that's what I was selling. She said that coconut flour, in fact, came from Copra, which she claimed sat around for months in the damp year. So it was prone to fungus, mold, and even disease. So this cheap flesh from the coconut is cheaply salvaged. Uh, most of it comes from the Philippines, and some people are sold um, coconut that comes from slave wages because there's not much money in this inferior form of coconut. To tell you the truth, I was truly shocked. Uh, this woman seemed very angry at me. I'd never met her before, and... I didn't know really what to say about all this. This seemed shocking to me, being that our uh, coconut flour at the time was five stars, uh, the highest rated one on Amazon, and it still is the highest rated one. So the truth is that real coconut flour has a ton of benefits. So these healthful characteristics are first, that it's gluten-free if you pack it in the right facility. So that's great for celiacs and gluten-sensitive people. It's hyperallergenic, so allergics uh, also uh, don't have to worry about it. It's low carb, um, so we know that it's good for the heart versus some of those regular flowers out there. Um, pardon my bad spelling of some of these things, but there's also some low sugar there in coconut flour. It's hard to absorb by the body. Um, so it doesn't spike your blood sugar. That's great for diabetics, of course, pre-diabetics. There is medium chain triglycerides, so there's some lauric acid in there for energy, and indigestible fibers, so it's great for detox. It pushes out what doesn't belong in the body. Uh, there's high protein. That's also great for vegetarians, weightlifters, as well as diabetics. And it's easily digested, so it's great for digestive issues. And as you can imagine, uh, with something like the indigestible fiber. It's also great for healthy weight loss and weight management. So what is the difference then between copra and coconut flour? Well, copra, it's good for animals, at least people say it is. Um, that is when it's sanitized. So if there is some mold on it after it's sitting around for so long, uh, it has to be purified. Um, it's fed to those animals as raw food, and that's actually why it can be problematic um, because it is known to be dangerous to humans. If animals eat this diseased food, guess what? The humans also get sick. It's known for mold growth, fungus growth, and it is cheaply produced, and it is naturally going to be stale. People who produce it don't get very much, and it's sold very cheaply, and obviously there's going to be sickness involved in the whole scene. Now, coconut flour is quite different. If you remember, that's the flesh from coconut milk. It's good for a large variety of people, used for smoothies, baking, cooking. It's rarely known to cause allergies because it's hypoallergenic. It's known to help in detox because all you know the, the lauric acid is there. It's antibacterial, and it pushes out all of the uh, fecal matter in the body that actually causes things like uh, cancer and other diseases. It's known to help to lower cholesterol. Uh, 
also being true that it, it is low in cholesterol. Uh, it's produced with an innovative, um, fresh technique, and that's why the product comes out fresh. And at least economic opportunity in all parts of the world, in different parts of Asia and Africa, and it's known to produce health. So are all coconut flowers the same then? Now, real coconut flour stays fresh for two years when it's packaged immediately. Many coconut flowers are shipped before they are packaged, so it can be an up to an eight-week process before it's finally delivered and on the store shelf or available even in an e-commerce store. When shipped to the USA, um, many of those coconut flour large bags are then processed in a GMO, gluten, or allergen containing facility. So you want to keep that in mind. So ask for coconut flour package in a dedicated or coconut only facility so you can avoid cross contamination. So in summary, about 99% of the population can benefit from coconut flour as a re re replacement. Remember all the statistics now about cancer and heart disease and diabetes, you know, one out of two, one out of three, one out of four. The percentages add up uh, for people who are susceptible to these diseases. And it seems that all of us are prone to get very sick at one point, And none of us really want to get diabetes or die from cancer or die of a heart attack. And this is a great way to prevent it. Though it's difficult to make pasta with, for example, it is fairly versatile. It's a tasty solution. And it's an answer to chronic diseases that are actually caused by wheat. Its health benefits go beyond any of the other flours, including almond flour. It's filling and very hearty, yet it's also good for a great variety of people. It's becoming more and more common at grocery stores because of this fact. So I want to just thank you for this watching this brief presentation as I can kind of air out what happened to me about Copra and the accusations that were leveled against me and coconut country living and all people who produce coconut flowers. You might want to ask your coconut flower uh, company if they do get their coconut flower from Copra. Um, if you notice our reviews on Amazon, uh, the constant theme is that our flower is very fresh and you can smell it as such right in the bag, even through the bag because of its power. We want to hear about you and your health journey. Uh, my own health condition led me to starting uh, Cuckoo for Coconut and providing our coconut flour to thousands of people. So let us know about your concerns and how you're doing with your coconut flour. And if you've even tried coconut flour, we give away a free coconut flour recipe book, as you'll see, and we'd love to hear how you even think about our recipes. So that's not all, folks. We did see some quality slacking in other coconut flours, and we wanted to address them and make you part of this. So I'd like to present to you Cuckoo for Coconut Organic Coconut Flour. It is going to be on sale until January 1st, that is 2016, where there might be some pricing changes. It's freshly packaged, so you don't have to worry about stale coconut flour, which is part of why it's five-star rated. Uh, great for a variety of recipes, but also very free, uh, fresh and tasty. It's competitively priced. So our bag right now is similar to the price of some one pound coconut flour, so you can get three pounds. It's also USDA organic certified. It's actually beyond organic. So we don't put um, ingredients like carrageenan in or even something like guar gum or um, uh, any other sort of uh, gummy product in our um, foods that we put out. There's a 100% satisfaction guarantee, in fact. So you're afraid of trying coconut flour? We're there to give you a little bit of courage. There is a 100% unconditional money-back guarantee. So we're so confident you'll be happy with Cuckoo for Coconut and the delicious recipes you receive that we're providing an unconditional money-back guarantee. So if you order today, you and your family can begin a virtual panoply of healthy and tasty dishes without gambling away your health. If you aren't 100% satisfied, just let us know. You can keep everything you have received. We want you to be happy and healthy and spread the word about the important message of staying healthy with a healthy flower. 
So yes, climb up the ladder of great health with some fresh coconut flour. Go get yours. And we'd like to thank you for this presentation and paying attention to our message about healthy coconut flour. In fact, we'd love you to get those free great coconut flour recipes, savory and sweet, as part of our gift to you. You'll get a special version of that uh, when you order on Amazon. So just click the button below if you'd like to check us out there. Uh, we do keep in contact with you, so uh, you'll get an email from us to find out how you're doing with your coconut flour, if you have any questions. And uh, we know a lot of people haven't even heard of coconut flour, or that it can be a gluten-free replacement that's 100% natural and also 100% nutritious. So we're here to answer any questions. If you want to click the button below, below you can actually uh, subscribe uh, to this channel for some more recipes. Um, we have some other coconut flour messages on another channel of ours, but this is going to be our main channel now uh, for CoconutCountryLiving.com. If you want to like the video and share it, uh, we'd love to hear what other people have to say as well. Maybe they know about their coconut flour com uh, companies and any other uh, controversies with Copra out there. We love to hear from you, and in the near future, you'll be hearing from my daughter who loves our Coconut Country Living theme song. We uh, Thanks for um, sharing some time with us today, and we'll catch you later.